that uh, this thing's gotten a going over. Um, first and foremost, we are looking at an original Elite. Operator Elite, or Elite Operator. Came operator. with multiple items. Two uh, GI mags, uh, a Dominator 2 EO Tech, riser, rear sight, a cantilevered scope mount, and then of course the intangibles, you've got the Rock River two-stage tri trigger in there, and the operator stock as well, which has a great features to it, we're going to cover that. Um, it did come with a uh, ergo grip, although in black, and, a, and to its credit it was a Gen 2. This is a Gen 1. Um, I, I think at this point you probably won't find any Gen 1s probably out there, but you want to make sure. The easiest way to tell if it's a Gen 2 is that the, uh, the, the butt plug uh, is connected, although you can buy them. Uh, in the inside of the Gen 2, it's a, more of a figure 8, like a cutout figure 8 design, and it does give a lot more rigidity to the grip, although this should be fine. The Gen 2 is a little bit better. So, basically, uh, from start to finish here, let's see if we can't do something here like this. Um, firstly, the, the rail that came with this was a great concept. It was a, you know, an aluminum free float. It was all smooth and then just had a quad rail on the front. Very nice concept, but came in at 19 ounces, which was horrific. So it was replaced with this YHM light rail, um, super, super high value. Um, I mean, these, this was $90, I believe, in that sense. Also, it had the fixed front sight. This is also a Yankee Hill machine gas block and folding front and as far as that goes this also came with a side sling mount as well and the nice thing was is all those extra parts were able to be sold off on eBay and uh, you know the, again if you look long and hard enough you will find uh, some value in the Rock Rivers one key note to uh, bring up is if you fall in love with one, you find a design, and I'm not sure if it's still going this way, but uh, ordering directly from them can take months. All the platforms that they put out or are offering are offered by outside dealers like Guns America, Gun Broker, and you're going to get it literally in two days. So that, that part's, uh, you know, I want to advise you on. You shouldn't you should be able to find it in the, out in the open market as opposed to directly from them. So the biggest, you know, the standalone feature that really sets this apart too is uh, it's got the R4 barrel and this thing is just a monster. I mean, you're not going to be able to see it, but it's, you know, as thick as, as thick as this cork underneath here. And again, it does add for the heft of it. It's the one downside of this whole uh, rifle, but it the barrel is absolutely monstrous heavy barrel and uh... It, you know it definitely going to add longevity but in hindsight it certainly it does add to the heft here um,